Yo guys, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showcasing a script for the Roblox game, A Universal Time. So before we get into today's video, if you could drop a like, comment, and subscribe, it would be greatly appreciated. Now let's get straight into the video. So to get the script, you want to go to the link in the description. From there, uh, you want to go ahead and execute, and this is what it will look like. So it's called Flames Hub, so you can use J on your keyboard. Or you can use this icon here to open and close the actual script so here in the home we've got bypass menu stuff so i'll bring this over here we can open inventory we can open ability we can open the shop the quest and the crafting menu so you can go ahead and navigate those then we've got local player like super walk speed super jump power we can reset character we also have ESP players, entities, auto fruit rain as well. So that is nice. Um, it's just a visual. It's not really uh, anything that you can go ahead and pick up. As you can see, I'm running over it or whatever. So it is just a visual. So keep that in mind. Uh, we've got troll scripts like big black mode, uh, auto frick daily quest and some other things here. In the fighting, we've got auto control click and wanting combo for the PC only. We've got auto dodge players and auto kill nearest player, uh, which is very OP. Now it does look like it puts us invisible, which is a really nice method. Um, so you don't get reported as often. Now this player looks very confused. Uh, you can go ahead or it puts us onto the map actually. So we can go ahead here and do farming and do auto uh, auto attack here so you can select all the different key bands on your keyboard and you can auto attack so let's go ahead and turn that off now, I'm not sure if we have to reset but it will be good uh, thing to do there which is reset character So, seems like we are a bit glitched out. Um, so, we can delete all the fruits as well, so we don't lag. So, here in the farming, we've got auto farming features, so we can do stats and attacks. And we can choose uh, distance, apply stats, auto ascend, the current ability collect playtime and daily rewards and we can go ahead and pick one now i don't really know too much about this game but this seems like it will be the best one here so we've got a few things we've got auto complete zoro quest auto one shot npcs so you can turn that on if you want. You can auto farm boundless and nearest mobs, auto skip boundless, auto farm debris and meteor, uh, meteors, auto equip the best farming spec. Then we can go ahead and select all the different people here, or you can select the boss as well. We can auto farm selected mob, and as you can see, it will go ahead and attack and you will level up. Now, I do recommend a private server or a alt account as you can get banned so as you can see it does work really well here and to go ahead and use our skills so it's kind of just going around all of them here and we are level 19 we will get leveled up quite quick especially if you go ahead and select a quest <coughs> which i have not done so we can also select chests and we can auto farm ground items. We can auto collect chest. We can sell items. So this is to exclude items so you don't sell it. Auto sell inventory. As you can see, we leveled up quite well there. Um, we can store items, pick up traits. We can do this here. Ability banner, managing crates, managing skins. So there's quite a lot here in the farming, so you can go through there and configure whatever you like, um, which is a really good option to have. So here in the quest, 
you can go ahead here and select a quest, auto tick select a quest, auto tick save the village quest, we can auto spawn bosses as well. So as you can see it did start the quest, I just have quite a lot, um, I'm not sure if you can check your quest, we can, so we got save the village, we've got craft, some other stuff, just starter, starter stuff. Um, but there's quite a lot in here. Teleports, me and spawn point, orange town, punk hazard, the port. So there is quite a few teleports here. If you scroll down, we've got credits here. So here it's made by the library and so on. So you can go ahead and join the discord or whatever you want to do here in the settings. We've got auto leave when someone joins, which is a VIP option. We've got delete effects. So it's a less laggy auto fix camera. We've got auto set rendering, which makes your GPU a lot better if you're farming for a longer period of time. We've got load anti lagger, which makes your game look horrible. But if you're lagging, then I do recommend it. Then we've got hide username, but it's a visual only. We've got a webhook manager. And uh, we've got restart the hub, close the hub and join the discord so here you can see the webhook manager as well so that is everything in today's video if you guys did enjoy then please be sure to drop a like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one bye bye